In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the blend door actuator in this Chevy Silverado. Let's get into it. There should be a cover under here covering all this, and this vehicle does not have that. You want to take those bolts out. You're going to use a seven millimeter socket, take those three or four bolts out, and then that cover will slide down. And we can access the actuator right here. Disconnect the connector, push down on the tab, slides off. Using a 5.5 millimeter socket, we're going to take the two screws out. On there. One there. And grab the actuator. And slide it down. The new actuator may in be indexed differently than the old one, so you want to get it started right on where the door is, that shaft, and then you'll twist it to the side and get these pins to line up and the bolt holes. Get those started. Snug those down. Not too tight. Take the connector, line it up, lock it down. At this point, you want to put the cover back up and put the bolts on. There is a relearn procedure for the actuator. What you want to do is turn the key in the on position and just wait one minute. The doors are going to be moving and recalibrating, but don't touch any of the heater controls. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.